7 Vital Points Buhari Made at the D8 Summit in Turkey President Muhammadu Buhari on Friday, October 20 in Istanbul, Turkey while making his speech urged D8 leaders to prioritize incentives and measures aimed at increasing trade and investments among member countries. President Buhari made seven vital points that could enhance the economic growth of Nigeria and attract business and investment opportunities among the members of states. President Buhari said the private sector and business communities in the economic organization must be assisted with incentives to widen economic cooperation among member states. President Muhammadu Buhari at the 9th D8 Summit at the International Convention and Summit Center in Istanbul, Turkey. Photo Credit, Twitter, Bashir Ahmad. According to him, as the D8, we need to intensify our activities with a view to enhancing various measures and incentives introduced to promote trade and assist the business communities from member states to invest in our countries and widen our cooperation. We need to work hard to establish integrated manufacturing structures and markets. I would like to reiterate the importance of increasing trade and investment among our member states. He also used the occasion of his speech to reiterate Nigeria's commitment to international trade and development even as he affirmed the country's readiness to host the meeting of D8 ministers of industry from November 14-17 in Abuja. The president stressed the need for prospective investors to take advantage of the federal government's new policies on trade facilitation. Nigeria is committed to, and is actively pursuing a policy of trade and investment facilitation for growth. The gains from trade are reflected in greater competitiveness, improved productivity, job creation, consumer welfare and prosperity. Economies that grow fastest and at more sustainable rates are those that actively promote trade and attract investment. We are committed to creating an enabling environment and making Nigeria an attractive place for business and investment, he said. President Muhammadu Buhari joins other leaders of the D8 to witness the signing of an between D8 and Islamic Development Bank in Istanbul. Photo credit, Twitter, Bashir Ahmad. He also urged D8 member countries to support the efforts of the African Union o, to establish the first ever single market for trade in goods and services on the continent. He described the OACT Continental Free Trade Area for Africa as a win-win for all, including member countries of the D8. I am pleased to inform you of positive market developments currently in Africa, that will support our efforts as members of the D8 to enlarge our markets, facilitate our trade and investments, and develop our economies. In Africa, we are on the threshold of finalizing negotiations to establish the first ever single market for trade in goods and services on our continent, in the continental free trade area for Africa. This will be a win-win for all, including member countries of the D8. As partners, I urge that we work together to support this effort of the African Union that will have a positive effect on global economic development and integration, he said. He also congratulated Turkey on assuming the new leadership of the economic organization. President Muhammadu Buhari joins other leaders of the D8 to witness the signing of an between D8 and Islamic Development Bank in Istanbul. Photo credit, Twitter, Bashir Ahmad. He assured D8 leaders that Nigeria would continue to support the Secretariat in its assignments to achieve the visions and objectives of the organization.